everyone and welcome to Musical Monday where every Monday we talk about music. For this week's video I'm really excited because within the last couple days a band that I used to listen to when I was younger finally is making a resurgence. I'm super excited for them and that is of course The Gorillas. Now if you don't know who The Gorillas are, The Gorillas are actually a fictional band that were started by Damon Albarn and Jamie Hewlett. I'm sorry I have to look at the computer just to make sure I get all my information correct for this one. So when Demon Days fully came out it was kind of the where they really shot up to fame and it was because Demon Days, especially Feel Good Inc, Dare, all of those ones really did such a good job in the way that they created music and it was something different from the typical pop music we were listening to and it was just oh it was so grungy and I loved it and then as the band progressed the music got a little different including of course with like Plastic Beach because then they were adding computers into it and really shaping what their soundscape was and very experimental and I loved every second of it. Well recently and when I mean recently, I mean more like March 23rd, four singles came out with the announcement of a brand new album called Humans, where we now see the fictional band having grown up. And you can see it specifically in Noodle, who is their Japanese guitarist. Super awesome. She had her own song called Dare. Super cool. But they released four different singles. In order that came out, it was Saturn's Bars, we Got the Power, Ascension, and Andromeda. All of which you can actually hear on Spotify. So why am I so excited that the Gorillas are finally coming back? Well, it's because the Gorillas did such a good job on like Plastic Beach and their single Clint Eastwood and Demon Days in general because it, they were so unique in their sound that just to hear them come back is super amazing. I love listening to their music, especially in Plastic Beach. You can really hear the calm and the difference of music because they did lose Russell somewhere in the storyline and they only had Noodle 2D and, oh God, what's his name? And I forgot the other one's name. I feel super bad. It was allowing them to kind of form into this other like chill soundscape. It sounded super cool. I'm just really excited and I just wanted to come out with this video for you all so you all got a chance to really listen to it. So what I'm going to do is if you visit the link in my description down below, it's going to send you to a Spotify playlist that I created specifically for Musical Monday. I've been kind of keeping very like back on it so I'm going to try to fix it but I'm going to add at least one or two of my favorite, favorite Gorilla songs to listen to, as well as the four new singles that just came out. So feel free to visit the description down below. And before I wanted to go out, I just wanted to give a huge shout out to Syracuse High School, Hunter Woodall, and all of those kids. You all are super cool. I really love you guys. Um, I miss you guys already because they are from Utah and they're super amazing and just absolute amazing human beings. So shout out to you guys. And thank you so much for watching this week's episode of Musical Monday. If you liked the video, please don't forget like and subscribe down below. I release new videos every single Monday and Thursday. All of my social media links, including the link to Return Home, The Way I See It, and my Musical Monday Spotify playlist will be located in the description down below. Thank you so much for watching and as always, my name is Forrest. Remember, Pink Cake. <gasps> Whoa!